Okay, so as long as there have been courageous men and women willing to protect our nation and our ideals, there have been extraordinary volunteers at our side. Patriots in their own right who serve and sacrifice in ways many cannot fathom. Their moms, their dads, their sons, their daughters, who take up the work of two during deployments, shuffling their careers and packing up their lives whenever our nation calls. Their dedicated employees at our businesses, committed volunteers in our communities, and essential caretakers for our wounded warriors and our families. Volunteers are at the core of the Highlander Brigade, and today we celebrate their contributions to keeping our country safe. Just as we are bound by sacred obligation to care for our men and women in uniform, we are e equally responsible for making sure our volunteers get the support and recognition they deserve. I voluntarily chose to serve my nation, protecting and defending the Constitution of the United States against all enemies, foreign and domestic. However, the volunteers recognized here today had no choice. While I chose the military lifestyle, they were born or married into it. Regardless of the circumstances you were born into, you can choose, as each of you did, to make a difference, to make the most of your circumstances and achieve greatness. As Martin Luther King Jr. so eloquently stated, everybody can be great because anybody can serve. You don't have to have a college degree to serve. You don't have to make your subject and verb agree to serve. You only need to have a heart full of grace and a soul generated by love. You decided to focus on the opportunities which have shaped you for your future. You see the world like every volunteer through a different lens, a lens that speaks to selfless service. Woodrow Wilson said that there is no higher religion than human service. To work for the common good is the greatest creed. A volunteer has a very astute understanding of what sacrifice means. You realize the importance of providing opportunities to those less fortunate, and because of the challenges presented, you have vowed to ensure all people are treated fairly. These opportunities have created a resilient, well-rounded person who embraces service and is capable of adapting to and thriving in any situation. Your positive attitude and your sense of humor are your hallmark. As a volunteer, you discovered early in life what many never come to realize, that a positive attitude and a genuine enthusiasm not only fuel the individual, but they also inspire those around you. You are positive, you are passionate, and you lead with your heart. The Chief of Staff of the Army, General Raymond Odierno, often says, our nation is strong because of our army, our army is strong because of our soldiers, and our soldiers are strong because of our families. I would offer that the Highlanders are strong because of our volunteers. Thank you.